What is up guys? Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be showing you two tips to give you better sound and audio. I am using the shield that I built right now to record this audio. So uh, I really do believe that it makes a big difference to get rid of and reduce some of the echo and just improve your sound quality, period. What I'm doing, I'm using an old pan. You don't want to use a really good pan and you want to put a hanger in there and just kind of you know, where it will bend at a certain angle. Alright, so now that we got the hanger boiling for right around 10 or 15 minutes on high, I'm going to pull it out. And this is the angle that we are looking for. You want to make sure it'll sit up on its own like it's doing right now. It's not leaning against anything, it's just sitting up on its own. The reason I'm building it out of a hanger is so that we can set it on the desk or hang it up on like a, you know, a road stand or something like that. As you guys can see, I got stock paper, scotch, uh, stuff. I do have the two little one, 12 by 12 like foam, studio foam, and then I have some duct tape. And you're obviously going to need some adhesive like, you know, foam spray tape the uh, the paper together the stock paper cardstock and then I laid the paper on top of a pillow to kind of give it the same angle as the hanger now we're just gonna tape it slide it up just a little bit I want it just above barely above it taped up and there we go there's the beginning of the shield Now we're going to jump to uh, the spray and I'm going to show you guys what it looks like. This is the spray I have. I have a whole room basically done out of this uh, kind of foam. So I did not have to buy any spray. You want to take it outside to spray it though. I sprayed it outside. I went ahead and put the panels on outside. I put them at this angle so the, the, this, the cardstock paper and the hanger won't be fighting each other. I mean you can put them at the other angle but as you guys can see it will bend with it. The way that the foam is, it'll bend with the hanger. Alright, so we're going to go over here and I'm going to show you guys where I'm going to be putting it. This right here is another tip for better sound, what I wanted to show you guys as well. As, as you guys can see, my microphone has like something around it. It's just a sock, guys. That's all it is. It's a sock with a hole cut in it and it does increase the sound. Massively will increase it. Obviously, the pop filter will help you out a little bit as well. But that sock is a, a big, massive difference. I'm going to go ahead and pop this thing on. And I'm going to show you guys what it looks like on. All I did was just hang it right over the top of the road. The reason I built it to where the hanger will sit up and support itself is if you have a microphone just sitting on the ground, like on a little stand, it'll sit right behind it. I can move the whole entire thing around. It's what I'm showing you guys a little bit. I'm moving it around a little bit. I just clipped it right over the top right here. Just hung it right over the top of it. Very easy. So now I can move my stand around. And I don't have to worry about it falling off. So you can move your stand wherever you want. And it won't look like crap. And plus it looks very professionally done. As long as you got it in a corner to where nobody can see all the tape on the back. If you're going to have it in a place where people are going to be able to see the tape on the back, you might want to buy some more different color cardstock and then you can tape over the back of it. Maybe use some more of the glue, the adhesive uh, foam spray, and just put it right over the back. I really, really do hope that this helped you guys out. I'm going to show you one more time the back where I got it clipped at. It sits really, really well. I can move it up. I can pull it back down. It looks really good. You guys see all my wires down there on the bottom? I just reset up my system in here. So I'm going to be moving all those wires and putting them up. Wires drive me crazy, guys. Drive me insane. All right, yo, I hope this helps you guys out. Be sure to drop that like, hit that sub button, and I'll see you guys on the next one.